Good morning guys, what's up? Welcome to my first um, training diary of the year. I am about half hour into my Yo, what's up guys? Um, so this is me halfway through my long run. Decided to take a quick break and film because I was originally planning on filming with my GoPro, but as you just saw, the battery ran out after a couple of seconds. Um, so yeah, this is the end of my first week. So Monday was strength training and for me that is basically kind of everything that I've learned from my physio over the last six months rolled into a single session to kind of keep that strength in my legs and my hips and all the other places where we discovered that was weak. Um, so it, it'll be stuff like squatting, deadlifting, calf raises, um, single leg squatting, single leg deadlifting, um, core stuff, plyometrics. Um, and that went really well. Always a good start to the week doing strength training. Um, Tuesday, where did I go Tuesday? Oh, yes, Tuesday morning I did um, hill work. So this was probably the most interesting workout of the week it was. Hill reps, so five hill reps, four flat fast one minute intervals and then three hill reps to finish so i think it was something like one minute two minute three minute two minute one minute of hills four by one minute of flat and then one minute two minute one minute of hills oh. So that started with a 30 minute warm up. Um, I was probably feeling a little bit stiff from the strength training the night before. Normally I wouldn't have two workouts so close together, like on a one night the next morning, but uh, it was the only place I could fit it in. So got well warmed up, did the session, it was wicked. Um, but the rest of that day I was walking like I just ran a race or something. So it was, it was a tough workout. Wednesday, this was, this is what I feel like is the most relaxing day of the week. So it is um, an hour bike ride, uh, but with some short, sharp, kind of hard sections. So it's eight one minute intervals throughout the hour uh, going hard, and then 30 minutes of strength training. Uh, Thursday was is normally when I do my club running session but because of COVID and everything being shut at the moment um, there's no running club so for this I've had to I decided to go on the treadmill for a change um, and I did one of the Nordic track workouts with Tommy Rivs so we ran the first part of the Grand Canyon um, rim to river to rim so I think it was about 45 minutes of downhill running. Um, really interesting after that run. Uh, the next day, my abs were really, really hurting. Um, like I'd done a really, really hard ab workout the previous day. And I was talking to my coach and he said he, he's experienced it on a couple of races that have had a lot of big downhill sections. So even though I didn't run that much downhill, it's probably... 45 minutes of constant downhill on a treadmill um, also mixed with the fact with on a treadmill as you're running you're kind of stopping yourself from going forward when you're running downhill it's a weird thing but uh, I imagine that had a bit of a uh, bit of involvement in it so then at that point the week had gone really well Friday went out for my run this was supposed to be hour and a half zone two with some strides to finish so got about 15 minutes in and my right shin started hurting and kind of the area in front of my ankle it all felt a bit weird so walked for a few minutes started to feel a bit better started running again 10 minutes later 
um, start certain again and kind of the calf in general. So at this point, that's when I really should have stopped and said, you know what, let's call this session today and just rest up and be good for tomorrow. But I kept going. I mean, I got the session done. I decided not to do the strides at the end, but came in feeling a little bit sore and was sore the next day as well. So yesterday, Saturday, which is when I would be normally doing my long run, I had to skip and I decided to do 30 minutes on the bike to try and kind of loosen up my legs and get some blood flow in and then did some strength training. Um, felt good, foam rolled a lot, um, did some static stretching, generally feeling a lot better today. So I came out, started to do my run and even though it's nowhere like Friday or yesterday, I just don't feel 100%. Um, so I've been taking it easy. Um, the first half of this run has been all uphill, so what I've done is it's mostly been hiking, which is fine. I've got to the top and now it's all downhill all the way home, so I should be able to run on the way back home. Um, like I said, it's not that bad, it's just not, it's not perfect, it's not what I want. So I'm going to try and take it easy today, get back home now, rest up, so that tomorrow when I start again, I'm fresh for the week. There's no point overdoing it on this one run when I'm not feeling great if it's going to then take away from my session tomorrow and take away from my session on Tuesday etc. So anyway, oh this arm is killing. Um, but anyway, I'm going to head home now and I think the plan is then to eat and do some foam rolling and just recover a bit and hopefully feel good ready for tomorrow. Hey guys, so I'm back from my long run and I thought I'd give you a quick update because it probably sounded quite negative when I was set up on top of the mountain, but um, that 45 minute run home was really good. My legs felt really good running back down the hill. Um, and now I've come in the front door, and I actually feel probably better than I did before I went out for my run. It was quite a positive one, even though I guess on paper it was probably slower than what I wanted, but I mean, there was no point pushing it today when I didn't feel quite right. Next week is gonna be very similar in terms of the, the sessions, only slightly tweaked. I know that the hill session I have on Tuesday will be different, but the rest of it will be fairly similar. So it's a, it's a case of just trying to progress slowly over the weeks. Okay guys, so that's me done for my training diary for this week. I'll be back again next week with week two of my training diary. Thank you for checking it out.